Now I realise that there are a lot of sprout shirkers out there, but I'm a big fan of these squeaky little bonsai cabbages, and I don't think a Christmas feast would be the same without them. So to everyone who says, I hate sprouts, I say, I just don't think you've had them the right way yet. What's needed is a recipe to convert the Brussels unbelievers. And I've got one right here, because today my sprouts are going to get roasted. To give my sprouts a lovely sweet savoury edge, I'm going to be roasting them with some shallots. Look at that. So pretty you could hang it on a Christmas tree. A shallot bauble. The smaller ones go in just as they are, while the bigger ones get cut in half. Yeah, that's shallot, mate. A good splash of oil, rapeseed or olive will do. Just give it all a little bit of a shuffle to get everything coated. Just going to give them a lift with a few sprigs of fresh thyme. These are caraway seeds. They've got a lovely festive fragrance and they go beautifully with brassicas. I often sprinkle them over simply steamed cabbage and they're going to go brilliantly with the Brussels. The roasting, of course, is going to give a whole extra dimension of taste as both the sprouts and the shallots get a little bit crispy and caramelised. And of course, this is an incredibly easy dish. All I need to do now is bang it in the oven. And after about 20 minutes in a hot oven, they're roasted to crispy perfection. Look at that. This is such a great way to breathe new life into an old Christmas favourite. It smells beautiful. It's brimming over with good flavours and a little bit of crispy caramel sweetness. And just to finish it off, a squeeze of lemon juice. And if there are any sprout doubters among the gang coming to the feast, then I think this will convert them into Brussels believers. <laughs>